Wait, wait, mother sucker. <laughs> My name is Ray and this is Hook to Cook. Fred Hall Show 2020 happening right now. You're not Hook here. You ain't house. nothing. Oh, hey. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Hook to Cook. We made it to the Fred Hall Show 2020. We got the whole crew here. Well, a little bit of the crew. Monica, Leroy, and Veronica. Ready shotgun. <laughs> so check it out. We rolled deep in the 2020 Honda Odyssey. Courtesy of Honda of Santa Maria. It's where your boy works. They hooked it up. But we're at the Fred Hall show right now, and we just arrived, and this is gonna be for you who are interested in what the Fred Hall show is all about. It's essentially a big melting pot, a big meeting place for all the biggest companies in terms of fishing. So it's a time where they show their best, they show new releases, and they have great deals. So this is the one in. Long Beach. But ultimately, we'll show you guys what's inside. We'll have some fun, we'll meet some people. It'll be a great time. Stay tuned. What's happening here? So, my wife sent me with some shoes to donate to Fishers of Men West Coast. So I got some brand new Skechers that we're donating to the Fishers Men of uh, West. Excellent, thank you. Brand new spankers there. Looks like kids, kids shoes. Well, or a small man. So. <laughs> yep. The new shoes will be given to people probably in Mexico or maybe here, maybe through the Boys and Girls Club. We've done shoe giveaways in Hawthorne and a few different places, but we're working on more. But we do two major ones in Mexico. One of them is 4,000 pairs of shoes in Los Barriles, Mexico. We also visit three or four different orphanages. Every kid gets a pair of shoes. Do what you can. Do what you can. It's not all about fishing. Do, you know, we we try and schedule fishing trips when we go places, but that's not what it's all about. It's about giving back. So you walk in, you're gonna buy a boat, and you just didn't tell me, right? Cause look, look, boat, 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 boat. Eye candy, as far as the eye can see. Okay, guys. <laughs> as soon as you enter, you're seeing. 100,000, 200,000, 300,000, 400,000 dollar boats as you walk in, top of the line, state of the art. Whew. Where do we sign? <laughs> Just kidding, that's surf life. You don't need all this to catch perch. <laughs> what do you think, honey? It looks good on you. Yes, there's like a little pop-up. There's a grill. Grill. Sink to clean the fish. It's perfect. Look at this cabin. All right, this is more realistic right here. <laughs> hey, Bob, look what we found. Bass boats. Bass boats galore. Oh, it's the RT-178. This thing, I've like, I drooled over. It's, it's an aluminum Ranger with like, all you need. <sighs> the reason I really like the aluminums is because you can launch them in skinny water. Look at this thing. Man. Was that just the appetizer? That was the appetizer, yeah. This is the main course and dessert. All in one? All in one. Yes, sir. You will now be, you will be surprised how many vendors are right here. Is that a black bass in the back? When they're babies, they have huh? spots. That's a baby black sea bass. You ever catch one of those, you gotta let it go. Oh, you know, have you seen the full grown ones out there diving? So that's why you're wondering how they have it, right? The sideways and reverse. Oh, wow. It goes that way. Oh, cool. It goes backwards. Or it goes sideways. So you don't have to take them out anymore and put them back in. Like the old days, yeah. 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 This is <laughs> this is one of the next 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 purchases. <laughs> Can't say it's gonna be anytime soon, but your boy's been looking on Craigslist for any used Hobie, so if you guys know anybody with a screaming deal and want to see some kayak fishing on the channel, keep your boy in mind. A Hobie. Definitely want one. Sooner rather than later. These things are beautiful. What do you think so far? 
Pretty cool. It's a candy store right now, guys. Almost got reeled in by the Hobie. The Hobie guys. But we're gonna hold out for a little bit. Until? Until later on this evening. And see how we feel. We're gonna throw one on top of the Odyssey. <laughs> in between us all. It'll fit. Yeah, we'll make we it. Got it. I'll hold on. <laughs> I'll ship it. We'll do right. ship. So this is gonna happen quite often, but we lost Leroy. We were kind of wandering around for a little bit, and then now we found Leroy again. <laughs> It's easy to get lost here. All right, so you literally need a map to look through this place. Well, check it out. There's probably, well, there is over a thousand vendors just in this room here. We're trying to locate a specific spot, which is somewhere in this neck of the woods. And you'll see, you'll see. This is all um, uh, Batson Enterprises. And um, Bill's owner over here, he brings a bunch of, great guy. Um, he brings a bunch of like legendary rod builders out and they do tutorials. So throughout the whole show, like for example, this guy right here, he'll be building that rod from start to finish. So they usually start like day one of the show and then by the end of the week, that rod gets raffled off. Wow. We'll also be raffling off all of these rods, I believe, over here. So definitely come back. So if you guys remember on the Santa Slade trip, the one who made the candy cane rod. Yes. That's Charles. That's me. That thing's amazing. You should see the other two I made. So beautiful. That, that the candy cane one was better, I think. So nice. So nice. Thank you, bro. Thank you. That's <laughs> dude. So good. Okay, can we get a picture? Get a I've had many, many conversations with these two and I've never met them in person. Oh, no way. Ever. Real quick, how can people find you? Instagram, uh, we got you hooked up. And uh, Facebook, Fish on Customs, fishoncustoms.com. Um, smoke signals. I'm okay with that. Text, if you know page your code, that's awesome. If you know page, if you know page your code, text me and I'll probably be able to read it. But then you're gonna date yourself. That's gonna be weird. <laughs> Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Get a little bigger and the kids will feed them. Yeah, so this is for the classrooms. Any teacher, any teacher that wants to do it, they can. Yeah, there's the program. Phone numbers in the back. You can give that if you have your kids and a teacher, and then to them say, why don't you do this? Public or private school? Doesn't matter. Don't matter. Don't matter. Okay. Yeah, doesn't matter. So we would be. And How much does it cost for them to get this whole set up? We sponsor some of them. We have some chillers and some of these, and sometimes the teachers will buy the equipment and stuff. The fish and game will we'll do the the eggs. Yeah. And they after 90 days, and the kids feed them and everything and after 90 days we'll do an outing. What's the well looky here. Hey, how are you doing? Oh my goodness. So we meet again. <laughs> hey I we're going up the booth and I came to see that song. I liked it around and I'm like <laughs> how are you? I know you. <laughs> uh, welcome. It's a reunion. Trying to find out if we can take limpets off the rocks with anything other than our fingers. Hey. How, and then you keep pulling, there's three more lines coming off. How is that possible? It's because you didn't get it out. You didn't make it taut. I want to share. I just want some havocs. How do you solve that? Alright guys, we got Wesley. He's very recognizable. This is the Cabo Surfcaster. <laughs> You guys need to follow this guy. What do you think so far? What do you think? This is your third uh, show. This third time I've been here. Yeah, this, this is a great show. Uh, you get to meet a lot of a lot of cool people. It's uh, it tends to be one of those ones where you know everybody's here trying to get a deal and stuff too. So um, between this and iCast, it's very different. Uh, iCast is just like an industry show, so yeah. nothing's being sold at the show. And, and this show, like everyone's buying stuff and deals are being made, so it's a pretty cool show. I like it a lot. You get, you get to meet a lot of cool people and a lot of interesting people. A lot, of, a lot of people who follow you online. Um, yeah. So. Dude, th this is what a, a fanboying Filipino looks like right now. <laughs> but um, so he's gonna do a, a talk. So not only can you buy stuff here, you can do like, seminars and stuff. And he's kind of a big deal. He's doing a main stage seminar in about. 
20 minutes. Yep, 20 so, minutes. We're probably gonna let him run, but how can they follow you? Uh, you can go find anything, Cabo Surfcaster. So Instagram, Facebook, uh, YouTube. Uh, go to anything, Cabo Surfcaster, or if you wanna shoot me an email, um, go through the website, cabosurfcaster.com. Um, yeah, usually uh, Instagram is where we're putting up like all the catches that we're getting right now, day to day, and you'll get links to some of the videos we're making. So I got a new video coming out right after, right after this show, I'll put it up on YouTube. It's a really cool video, catching a yellowtail off the beach. And rooster fish, and yeah. Kubera snapper, uh -huh. all the stuff we dream of. Angel, you fished with him, and yeah. uh, Joe Albert, you were supposed to fish with him, but it didn't happen. <laughs> John B's fished with him. Dude, uh -huh. he's the man. We're gonna let him go. Yeah, good to see you, bro. So awesome. Yeah. Okay. Check this out. This one's for you, Bob. What were you saying about one day not being enough? We haven't even been halfway <laughs> through yet. And it's already four o'clock, so. Veronica and Monica work their magic. Leroy. The Ink Vader. I've been trying to get this forever. Nobody has it. Now I have one. Thanks to Veronica and Monica. Kind of rhymes. <laughs> so this bait actually has like ink tablets that you put in, and then when you lift it, it leaves like a, a black ink trail. Just like a real octopus. And it's got a big weight in it. Perfect for lingcod. But gosh, we're like making one pass and we're not even like a third of the way through this whole thing. We're running into people we know, which is really cool. And all we can say is <laughs> it's going to take more than one day to really do this place justice. So if you plan on coming to the Fred Hall show in Long Beach, definitely plan on doing at least two days, at least. You know, these are like five, six hundred dollar reels now, right? Yeah. So you want to you wanna protect it. Basically, this is what it looks like. And basically, you just put it on wet, and you just kind of massage it down, and eventually it looks like this. By in about two minutes, it, it looks like this. So it's it's you can feel that it's on there, but it's very protected. Yeah, yeah. It's this stuff is really strong. It, it's really strong. It won't. Yeah. You can't you can't you can't tear it. It's yeah, just like self on top of all. What's up, guys? <laughs> Thanks for tuning in to Hooked to Cook. Be sure to check out my channel and leave this one. Straight up. <laughs> I'm just messing with y'all. No, he's serious. Well, shout out to serious. this guy for coming through. He's serious though. His, his, his channel's linked below. This is none other than Bears G. Kind of doesn't need an introduction, but it's cool that we get to connect. Yeah, he needs to come down yeah. and fish with me and get him some big old bat rays while he's up there catching panfish. <laughs> Like, like this up if you guys want to see some spotted bay bass, halibut. What else? What, what else is your specialty? Mackerel. Mackerel. It <laughs> so, gets it's a top smell. Monster smell. Monster. Well, we, we, we do got corvina. If you guys are from the east coast, speckled trout. We got corvina over here. Same family. Good eating. And uh, hopefully put this guy on some. That's right. Throwing a rigs. Throwing, of course, major craft, jig para. What else? Uh, so Kalisa. <laughs> okay. He's be on a Kalisa game, so definitely I'm gonna be throwing out this season. So you guys stay tuned for that. Be sure to check out my channel. It should be in his description below. It will be. <laughs> it will be, guys. It's official, ladies and gentlemen. First purchase, right here. <laughs> it's happening. It's happening. You guys will see uh, some experimental videos throwing these on the Central Coast. These yeah. are brand new. When were these were just released, right? The Surf was just released actually this year, or well, actually uh, today, in the states. They were in Japan, but finally, we got a market for them here in the States in California. If you guys seen my videos before, Bears G, by the way, you guys know me for this bait. Right here, Jakara Spin. This is a spotty killer, halibut killer, and a bat snagger. So, <laughs> you guys know me for this. You guys like throwing this, you guys will love throwing this bait. This bait is like a hybrid between a standard iron, so if you're looking at a standard iron, this is a micro slim with a fat body. Comes with a Colorado blade. The body is fat like a teardrop. When you actually crank this, it actually wobbles. And while the blade is spinning, while the blade is spinning, it gives it that little teardrop wobble. And it's a constant retrieve bait. You can pop it. It will not hang up. This bait will hang up. This one won't. But if you guys want to cast a mile, no skill whatsoever, dummy proof bait, right here. <laughs> I mean, I caught well over 100 fish already. I don't know, you guys check out that video, J Street, Bears G, check that video out, me using this bait. Yeah. Yeah, so that's next. We'll, we'll try some, something new. You know, if you guys have been on this channel for a while, you know we experiment. We try different things in the surf. Things that work, things that don't work. 
but we tell it like it is, and we're gonna try these out. Because Tony said so. Bling bling, mother sucker. <laughs> it's squid, and they eat squid in the right. salt water, and what, being on mono, and I designed these hooses with an engineer. They're made to twitch and pulsate, so it's an instinctual, so they see it, and they, they, they commit to it not like 30%, there's no chasers. Yeah. See, it's whoosh, they, it's yeah. right now. Yeah, they, they hit it really violently. Oh, and really? We'll um, see if the surf perch like that too. Yeah, 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 yeah. that's here. awesome. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. I'll, I'll run your car, just two of them? Yeah, just okay. two of them. That's fine. Yeah, there's seriously so much to see <laughs> that, that is a full it. day okay, does not do this fun. place justice at all. At all. It's ridiculous. So we're your chronicles, baby. This is the man. Let's go. Yeah, it's yeah. on. Hey. What's going on? Fred Hall Show 2020 happening right now. If you're not here, you ain't house. nothing. Oh, hey. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, man. Huge nice fan. Huge oh, fan. Thank you. Thank yeah. you so much. Right. Hello. The producer, Danny. Okay. Okay. Uh, this is my wife, Veronica. Hi, I'm Jeff. I've seen your videos. I've seen her in your videos. Dad in your videos. Yeah, we're all in them. Yeah. So I talked to Edward Halterman today. I'm like, you're gonna come down and see Edward? And he goes, No, I'm not coming to the show. Yeah. Really? He's he's leaving to go to South America on uh, Friday. So. Oh. You hear that, Edward? You should be here, buddy. You should be here. That guy. Is that guy? <laughs> Oh, not that guy. <laughs> <laughs> but the stories you must have. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Ridiculous. Right, you have an idea how many the travels, and they're not even done yet. Yeah, no. I think the Tonga. Yeah. Tonga. I had to look it up. We have to stop in Fiji <laughs> on the way. Oh god. Oh, god. And they have an oh. eight-hour stay, and they've already <laughs> planned stuff for us to do. I'm gonna meet the king of Tonga. The king? Yeah. yeah. So stay tuned. Sergio yeah. in Tonga will be hitting your living room. On Angler Chronicles, Fox Sports West, you'll see Sergio in Tonga breaking the news right now. It's a hook to cook exclusive. <laughs> Just kidding. That's so cool. That's that is so cool. Oh yeah, great work, great yeah. work. Yeah, Thank you. amazing, amazing. So he literally ran from Sergio to come back here because Jig Para Majorcraft is doing a raffle. So let's film whoever wins. <laughs> If it's us, great. If it's not, it's great. Big or small, catch them all. Scoot in. We don't bite hard. <laughs> what if we like it hard? Ooh, I'd leave that to the missus. Nine, six, eight, one, zero, eight, nine. Yay! What? <laughs> the I thought you were joking. I go, you don't do that. I would never do that. Yes, what you do. You pretend that I won? Oh, yeah. funny. <laughs> I'm glad you really won. I was worried. I give her two tickets and she wins. <laughs> That's awesome. 1290? 1290. That's it, right here. Wow. Okay. Yeah, okay. Right. So what the hell? Wow. I'm not cheating either. I didn't pay you anything. <laughs> but my, my, my purchase. It, it pays to buy stuff. Yeah. I bought a lot, but I didn't. Yeah. All right, all right. It's 961108. Woo! All right! Woo! Women are hot. Now the next one's going to be you. What'd you win, honey? What is it? A rod? A rod winner. And? Oh, you won the rod. That's what? It. Yeah. What'd you win? That's the grand prize. You won the grand prize? Yeah. Is it really? Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll let you guys know more details about that rod when we're done. Okay. okay. We can get okay. The that is so legit. How the hell did that just happen? <laughs> uh, 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 it's kind of awkward. <laughs> One, two, three. That's so dope. No, no, no. Tell us about the rod now. Tell us about the rod now. What did she win? What did she right. win? So you guys want a light jigging rod. You guys do that rock fish and lean cod trips. This is perfect. Oh god! It drops straight down. The bend on it is phenomenal. It's made for vertical jigging for yellowtail, lean cod, anything, whatever is down four, four, five hundred feet. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I was using this and I hooked up on that sixty-pound bat ray at the dock. Dude. Yeah. And I was bending. I was trying to break the rod, but apparently they don't break. <laughs> there you go. So man. what do you pair with this? What's you say you got a tra trace three hundred at home. Tranks 400. That's fine. Yeah? That's Tranks, fine. Tranks 400. If you, Dude, watch those, so if you go online and look at those Japanese hold on, hold on. guys vertical jigging, 
They're using big reels yeah. and they're just ripping it. It's two pieces. Okay. So we're doing this. We're looking at it. The unboxing. This is the unboxing right here. This is the handle. If you guys are not familiar, Japanese two-piece rods are usually from the handle. Oh yes. Now. Right. So it's a two-piece rod, big cast. In case you drive a Miata or convertible insane. or something. Hope none of you guys do. But uh, yeah, just like that. Soft tip. Wanna hold it? Wanna check that bed? Oh. <laughs> Dude, the Tranks 400 on this is gonna be beast. Yeah, Tranks 400, 300 size, you're perfect. Bottom fishing, How? Good to go. How? This thing's so, so skinny. Welcome to the Japanese market. Jeez. <laughs> it was meant to be. It was meant to be. So that was pretty unbelievable, pretty epic. <laughs> we ended up winning the light jigging setup that apparently can handle link cod and rockfish. And this thing is like super, super skinny. It's wild, wild. You guys saw it, so stay tuned. If you guys want to see videos where we're using that rig, stay tuned. We're gonna get it. But right now, we're gonna meet up with Monica, Leroy, and all of them. This has just been really crazy, and we haven't even seen half of this show. So <laughs> we'll see if we can film anything else that's pretty cool, but so many people here. What's cheaper? Oh yeah, before I forget, Thank you again, Jig Para. You guys hooked it up with a casting jig. This is gonna put some rockfish on the plate for sure. <laughs> Edward, you must come back. Hook to cook. This is a place to come to talk, to schmooze with all the other fishermen, to buy all kinds of gear and swag and really get your hands on stuff. And sometimes you win really cool stuff. But I'll leave that to Edward to tell you about that. Hook to cook. It's a small trout. Very small one. Catch these guys. Diamond does. Discount coupons for you. Thank you. Thank you. I think this one. This one and that one. That one's so pretty. We stock every single Thursday without fail. And we close that day to allow the fish to kind of spread out and dissipate. So we open Friday morning early. And so Friday, Saturday, Sunday is all great fishing, and uh, even into the early early part of the week when there's fewer people, right. you know, it's still great fishing. You know, the day turning into what things turn into. <laughs> so what just happened is, <laughs> so there's there's all these like vendors that like set up trips and uh, different excursions that you can go on, uh, and some of them are all inclusive. And this happens to be a lady who lives really close to us. Who happens to, the, to know Monica and Leroy, and uh, we may or may not have just booked a week out in Canada for some salmon and some halibut and some link cod. So definitely stay tuned for that. There's so much to stay tuned for. It's ridiculous, ridiculous. I don't know about you guys, but my knees are killing me. Yeah. So that was a lot of walking, guys. This was great. Ended up winning that rod at the Major Craft booth. <laughs> Pretty stoked, that was a highlight. But we met so many cool people. We even met Guy Jeans on the way out. That was epic, Kern River Fly Shop. Definitely shout out to you guys. Experience overall? Pretty cool, man. Pretty cool. Definitely need a little more time to go through the booths, but overall success. Definitely. So next year, Fred Hall Show. Thank you, Leroy, for come down and get a hotel. Spend two days down here. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> Looks like the ladies had fun too. Yay! Woo! We came. We saw. We conquered. Yay! Yeah. Buckalucks. Buckalucks. We'll catch you guys later. <laughs>